The Bombardier Challenger 650 received EASA certification this week. This news comes three weeks after the aircraft is certified by the FAA. The 650 has a 4,000 nautical mile range and 5% more takeoff thrust than its predecessor, the Challenger 605. Embraer's recently announced financial results shows that the company's business aircraft division has met their projections. Additionally, Embraer's revenue of $5.93 billion met their revenue projections, which were estimated between $5.8 to $6.3 billion. Attendees of the Abu Dhabi Business Aviation Expo faced unexpected heavy rain, wind, and flooding. Multiple exhibits, furniture, and even aircraft were heavily damaged by the inclement weather. Fortunately, despite the damage, no injuries were reported. Amazon is expected to lease 20 Boeing 767s in support of its fulfillment services. The 767s will be leased from Air Transport Services Group, or ATSG, for five to seven years and be operated by the company's airline subsidiaries. Fleet is expected to support Amazon's one- and two-day deliveries. The FAA announced a proposed rewrite of Part 23, which regulates aircraft certification. The new rules are expected to decrease the time to implement new technology and reduce certification costs. The rewrite is expected to be the largest in FAA history.